Hey everyone, it's Father Mark, and we are continuing with Katie Warner's wonderful little prayer booklet, A Parent Who Prays, uh, going through this today, and we are talking about uh, friendship today. We're talking about relationships with friends. A wonderful way to start off, and, and, and of course, it's all based on God's love for us. Jesus reminds his disciples, he reminds us in the 15th chapter of the Gospel of St. John, I no longer call you servants, I call you friends. That wanting to know who the other person is. And, and oftentimes in friendships, uh, we don't quite know why we click with certain people and we don't click with other people. Why he becomes my friend, but that other person doesn't. Why the friendship that deepens greatly happens with one person and not with another, whom maybe we seem to have a much more in common with than the other. But I think what we are trying to do with relationship with our friends is reminding ourselves of deepening that relationship is a gift that is given to us by God. And that relationship isn't a relationship of using the other, but rather it's entering into the life of the other, getting to know the other person deeply, and profoundly. And once again, not forcing it, right? Oftentimes, I remember when I was a little boy or teenager, even a young adult, I said, I want to be a friend with that guy or that girl over there. I'd like her to be my friend. And yet it never turned out. But rather, living our lives as authentic witnesses to God's love for us, knowing that Jesus calls us friend, and by living that authentic witness to who God calls us to be, then those around us begin to understand that, and we see others in the light of that gospel, where we're not using them to get something, but we're beginning to find the true person, the true blessing in our friends. So I think oftentimes for uh, our children, especially during this time of uh, not seeing our friends as much as we would hope to, that cultivating friendship takes a really intentionality, right? So I'd encourage you maybe to, to have your children send a card to people they consider their friends, right? To uh, do those natural things of, be of and beyond the electronic stuff. I know we can Zoom call, Skype, Facebook, FaceTime, whatever it is you use, right? But to do something intentional that reaches out, making that gift of friendship tangible and real in who we are, and then allowing their, your children to explore the gift of friendship, not demanding that they get to know this person or that person, but allowing them to discover the blessing of friends in their lives on their own. Anyways, that's the three minutes on relationship with friends today. Uh, let us continue to give joy and blessing to God in the hope and love of our Lord Jesus Christ. And please continue working with us. We're almost done. Just a few, uh, few more uh, lessons to learn about friendship, and then we will move forward. God bless you all. Have a wonderful week.